Greetings, dear JKSSB aspirants. In this video presentation, I will cover multiple choice questions, MCQs, from the General Knowledge Unit, focusing on demography census, its features, and functions. I encourage you to explore additional sources such as Google searches or other YouTube channels for further conceptual clarity. Let us try to solve some important MCQs one by one from the topics. Question 1. What is the primary purpose of conducting a census? A. To determine the literacy rate. B. To collect demographic data of a population. C. To assist the economic growth of a region. D. To determine the healthcare facilities available. The correct answer to question 1 is option B. To collect demographic data of a population. Explanation Census aims to collect comprehensive demographic information such as population size, distribution, age, sex ratio, etc. Question 2. In India, which organization is responsible for conducting the census? A. Ministry of Home Affairs B. Ministry of Statistics and Program Implementation C. Election Commission of India D. Indian Statistical Institute the correct answer to question 2 is option A. Ministry of Home Affairs Explanation The census in India is conducted by the Office of the Registrar General and Census Commissioner under the Ministry of Home Affairs. Question 3. How often is the census conducted in India? A. Every 5 years B. Every 10 years C. Every 15 years D. Every 20 years the correct answer to question 3 is option B. Every 10 years. Explanation The census in India is conducted once every 10 years to gather comprehensive demographic data. Question 4. Which of the following is not typically collected during a census? A. Population size. B. Religion. C. Household income. D. Education level. The correct answer to question 4 is option C. Household income. Explanation While census data includes population size, religion, and education level, household income is usually not directly collected. Question 5 The census is conducted to collect data on which of the following? A. Economic growth. B. Demographic characteristics. C. Political affiliations. D. Environmental factors. The correct answer to question 5 is option B. Demographic characteristics. Explanation The primary purpose of the census is to gather demographic data such as population size, age distribution, sex ratio, etc. Question 6 Which census year saw the first electronic data collection in India? A. 1981. Born in 1991. Circa 2001. D. 2011. The correct answer to question 6 is option. Circa 2001. Explanation. The 2001 census was the first to introduce electronic data collection methods in India. Question 7. What is the primary purpose of collecting data on literacy during the census? A. To assess educational infrastructure. B. To determine the need for vocational training. C. To formulate policies for literacy programs. D. To assess the standard of living. The correct answer to question 7 is option. C. To formulate policies for literacy programs. Explanation. Data on literacy helps in formulating policies and programs aimed at improving literacy rates. Question 8. What is the census motto of India? A. Your right to know, our responsibility. B. Our census, our future. C. Know your people, plan your future. D. Census for prosperity. The correct answer to question 8 is option. C. Know your people, plan your future. Explanation. The motto emphasizes the importance of knowing the population for better planning and development. Question 9. Which census year saw the highest population growth rate in India? A. 1951 
born in 1971 circa 1991 d 2011 the correct answer to question 9 is option a 1951 Explanation: The 1951 census recorded the highest population growth rate in India's history. Question 10: What is the purpose of collecting data on religion during the census? A. To monitor religious diversity. B. To promote secularism. C. To assess the need for religious institutions. D. To evaluate religious conversion rates. The correct answer to question 10 is option A to monitor religious diversity. Explanation: Data on religion helps in monitoring the religious diversity of the population. Question 11: What is the minimum age for being considered as a senior citizen in India as per census data? A 55 years. B 60 years. C 65 years. D 70 years. The correct answer to question 11 is option B 60 years. Explanation in India individuals aged 60 years and above are considered senior citizens as per census data. Question 12 What is the main objective of conducting a socio-economic and caste census SECC? A to assess the literacy rate. B to identify households living below the poverty line. C to determine the unemployment rate D to evaluate healthcare facilities The correct answer to question 12 is option B to identify households living below the poverty line Explanation SECC aims to identify households living below the poverty line to facilitate targeted welfare schemes Question 13 In the census what does the term scheduled tribes refer to A indigenous tribes B economically backward communities C socially disadvantaged groups D urban slum dwellers The correct answer to question 13 is option A indigenous tribes Explanation scheduled tribes refer to indigenous or tribal communities historically marginalized and residing in specific geographical areas Question 14 What is the purpose of collecting data on housing conditions during the census? A to assess the need for infrastructure development. B to determine property taxes. C to evaluate real estate markets. D to assess the availability of rental properties. The correct answer to question 14 is option A to assess the need for infrastructure development. Explanation data on housing conditions helps in assessing the need for infrastructure development and housing policies. Question 15 What is the purpose of collecting data on migration patterns during the census? A to analyze commuting patterns. B to understand urbanization trends. C to assess cultural diversity. D to evaluate tourism trends. The correct answer to question 15 is option B to understand urbanization trends. Explanation data on migration patterns helps in understanding the movement of people and urbanization trends. Question 16 in the census what does the term non-resident Indian NRI refer to? A foreign nationals residing in India. B Indian citizens residing abroad. C stateless individuals. D individuals with dual citizenship The correct answer to question 16 is option B Indian citizens residing abroad Explanation NRIs are Indian citizens residing in foreign countries for employment education or other reasons Question 17 Which of the following is not a feature of the census in India A voluntary participation B mandatory participation C confidentiality of data D regular intervals of data collection The correct answer to question 17 is option B mandatory participation Explanation participation in the census in India is voluntary although it is highly encouraged Question 18 What is the purpose of collecting data on household amenities during the census 
A. To assess property values. B. To evaluate environmental sustainability. C. To determine the standard of living. D. To analyze housing affordability. The correct answer to question 18 is option C. To determine the standard of living. Explanation Data on household amenities helps in assessing the standard of living and socio-economic status. Question 19 In India, which census year was the first to include questions on disability? A. 1981 Born in 1991 Circa 2001 D. 2011 The correct answer to question 19 is option D. 2011 Explanation The 2011 census was the first to include questions on disability, reflecting a growing recognition of disability rights and inclusion. Question 20 Which term refers to historically oppressed communities in India? A. Scheduled tribes B. Scheduled castes C. Other backward classes D. General category The correct answer to question 20 is option B. Scheduled castes Explanation Scheduled castes refer to historically oppressed communities who were subjected to social discrimination. Thank you everyone. Don't forget to subscribe to my YouTube channel Education and Teacher Education at Shoki Bilal.